I've been a consultant uh, for Tier Lab for quite a few years now, and I'm excited about uh, their new rebranding of uh, Scout Pro, which is a handheld a device that uh, is much more portable, more efficient, uh, and really has a nice focus on corneal health. Dry eye disease is probably the number one reason why patients are unhappy or dissatisfied after cataract or refractive surgery. So I think it's really important that we screen these patients and identify patients that have signs and or symptoms of dry eye disease. In 2015, we published a paper in JCRS showing that patients with dry eye disease and hyperosmolarity had greater variability in their K readings and IOL power calculations compared to normal osmolar patients. And in the hyperosmolar patients, they had a greater than one diopter difference uh, in uh, measured corneal astigmatism. So again, that really emphasizes the importance of really measuring, you know, uh, point of care tests, including tear osmolarity uh, in these patients coming in for cataract or refractive surgery. I'm really excited about the new Scout Pro device, which is a single handheld device that makes it much more portable and efficient in the office. So you no longer have to take the lab device and put it into the system. You actually just take this directly to the patient, which again, really helps to improve the flow and efficiency in the office. If we really pay attention to the ocular surface and screen these patients, we're gonna really help to reduce the number of uh, refractive misses. And I think that, you know, tear osmolarity is key to that. And is part of the um, ASCRS algorithm in, you know, in helping to kind of really address these patients that have ocular surface disease. You know, after uh, seeing the results from our uh, study that we published in JCRS, I really feel strongly that measuring tear osmolarity in all our patients coming in for uh, cataract refractive surgery should be standard of care. So using this point of care test, this tear osmolarity system, really helps to identify our patients that are at risk for uh, refractive surprises. So again, you, we want these patients to have the maximum visual outcomes and um, the highest satisfaction.